I don't know if you guys heard what came out of uh, Kyle Petty's mouth about Kyle Bush. Yeah, I heard it. Uh, I didn't necessarily agree with a lot of it just because it was coming out of his mouth. And granted, yes, is there's something true to what he said. Yes, there's always some truth in a lot of things. But you know, when you say he has earned the right to be you know, selfish and to have a certain asking price, like, I know Kyle Bush and a lot of, like people that won championships are asking for, you know, top dollars. It's just the way it is. And yes, Kyle did earn it just like when Kevin got his sponsorships to, you know, extend or Joey Logano just you know, got a big extension. Ryan Blaney got, you know, got an extension, which means he got his sponsors to stick around like all these people. You know, Bubba, with one win, just got the extension, which means his sponsor stuck around. You know, if those guys can all have their asking price and get sponsors all the time, especially Bubba, because he's only done, he's only won one race. You know, and otherwise, like, top tens are not consistent with him at all. You know, it's just, you know, fact of life, and I find it amazing you know, that they all get theirs and that's okay. But then like Kyle Petty telling Kyle Bush that he needs to not be selfish and make sacrifices to, you know, and he shouldn't be asking that much. He has to make sacrifices. Oh, he, well, guess what? Oh, we all have to do it. Yeah. That's what his kids are at that age, dude. Like he's really like, he say, what if I'm not going to be spending as much time with family? They're going to start doing something. Yeah, like he deserves his money. I'm sorry if everyone else is getting their money, why shouldn't he? And my problem with Kyle Petty saying it is, where the hell would Kyle Petty's career have been if he wasn't Richard son? So I hate to break it to him. He didn't deserve nearly as many good rides as he got after the career and the amount of wins he had. There's people that have done way better that are in way worse situations. Yeah, that are having a harder time right now. Like Kyle Bush. Who's won championships? He has KBM. Like he's done a lot for the damn sport. Just won a championship not that long ago. Deserves all of everything he can. And like just for like he wouldn't even have his job right now if he wasn't the king's son. In my opinion, I'm sorry, people might not like that opinion. I really don't give a damn if you like that opinion or not. You know, sorry, not sorry. He should not be able, he wouldn't be where he was if it wasn't for being the king's son. I'm just, you know, I'm there. Like, he'd look at all the stuff he's getting after having a very mediocre career. And like, he, he makes jokes about it. everyone does, admitting everything, all of that. You know, and look at everything he has in life just because of who he is. I'm sorry. I, I, if Logano and everyone else, Denny, all of them can have, you know, Denny and them are getting everyone that Martin signed, you know, the year extension at Gibbs, and you know he's getting paid. So I just find it really sketchy that Kyle, of all of them, can't find anything, can't get anything, and everyone's telling you need to make sacrifices, la da 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 da. Like, congratulations. Like, what does that have to do with anything? Like he's earned whatever the hell he wants. Not sorry when I say that. He really has earned whatever the hell he wants. That asking price is his asking price. And other people in his team that have won championships are getting you know, high asking price, high dollar stuff. So why shouldn't he be able to? Like I'm not even trying to, you know, be a terrible person when I say it. You know, it it just doesn't make sense to me. Never will. And no offense to Kyle Petty again. Like, he did win races and all that, but he wouldn't have gotten nearly as much as he did because of his career stats if he wasn't Richard's son, in my opinion. Like, he's good at the sport. He's great. For, he loves the sport. He has passion for the sport. But his driving stats didn't add up to being anywhere near where he is. And to be telling him he needs to sacrifice like you can't say that someone 
earned, you know, their lifestyle and to ask for whatever they want and then tell me they need to make sacrifices without being so selfish in the same breath. Like it just does not work that way. I have a problem with that. You can have a problem with me for having a problem with that. I don't give a. F- no, no, no. No, I don't. Doesn't make sense to me. And I think there's just God knows what's really going on with the whole Kyle thing, but you know, it's weird. But again, look at all the other champions and nobodies that have gotten, you know, they're getting, you know, money. There's sponsorships still, you know, need all of it. And the people in the organization with Gibbs are getting contract extensions and sponsors. There's just so, I just, I don't know. It's just weird that Kyle can't get anything. And people are telling him he needs to make sacrifices and stop being so selfish in the NASCAR world and team, like on the broadcast team and stuff doing that. I just don't like it. So it's like coming from him again. If it was someone else, sure. But no offense to Kyle Petty. Again, I know I keep saying, where would his career be if he wasn't Richard's son? You can say the same thing about Junior, whatever, but Junior Motorsports, look at everything they're doing for the sport. All the drivers, all the talent, wins, money, like all the stuff that they're doing. Like So he's had a life outside of the track to stay in the sport, not just broadcasting and be part of it. And I just don't like someone like Kyle Petty going and you know schmearing him, telling me he needs to make sacrifices when look at every when everything he has is just because of who he was. It was it wasn't off the just those few short little wins that Kyle Petty got again. You can hate me for it, but that's just the way I feel about it. Like you just shut up. Literally, just stick to what you're good at and don't talk about anyone because Again, look where he is because of who he is. It's not off of wins. It's not off of owning a race team and doing this. It's not off of championships because the last name is Petty. You know, I hate to be the guy to say it, but that's my big problem with it. My huge problem with it. Everyone else should have the problem with it. I hope the best for Kyle Bush. I hope the best for Kyle Petty. Yeah. But You know, why is everyone else allowed to ask for their big dollars and all that for paychecks and salaries and you know, whatever on top of the sponsorship money and get it? But Kyle's a selfish bastard because he's asking for whatever he wants with all the championships and everything he's done. Like if everyone else can ask for it, why does he have to sacrifice and not ask for the same thing? As you know, the Loganos and the Truexes and all of them are asking for just Hamlin, asking for just as much big bucks. And no one said a word to them. No, that's it. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Again, comment what you think, like it, subscribe, follow along, share it out, and enjoy your week. Peace.